Welcome to my favorite place, it's Happy Harbor. We'll have so much fun playing with our friends. There's all of the bear and Tilly the penguin and an octopus named Kelpie. God wants to be our friend? God made us, and God loves us too. I think God is a really good friend because he is nice and strong, and he's good at making things. Oh, and he makes everything so much better. I think Kelby has a picture of someone who is friends with God. Let's see if he can show us. Come close and look through my spyglass with me, friend. Do you see Kelby yet? Oh, there he is. Hi, Kelby. Hi, Arlo. And hi, friend. Kelby, I was hoping to learn about someone new today. That sounds fun. Can you open your treasure chest and see who it could be? I can do that, Arlo. I'll just open up my treasure chest and... Uh-oh! Bubbles! <laughs> can you help me pop them? All right. Here we go, let's pop some bubbles, yeah, yeah, 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 let's pop, 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 and bubbles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Pop, 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 and yeah, pop, 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 and yeah. Helping me. We popped so many bubbles. Now let me see who is in here. Who is this? That's Daniel. He was good friends with God. Thanks, Kelby. You're welcome, Arlo. I am so happy that we get to learn about Daniel today. He was friends with God, and God wants to be our friend too. I remember there was something special about Daniel's story. Hmm. Let me see if I can find the book with Daniel's story in it. I'm looking for the Bible. It's God's special book for us. Oh, yeah. Here it is. Oh, that's right. Daniel's story has lions in it. Roar! <coughs> Yay! The Bible train is here. Let's meet up with Tilly and see a story with her. Come on, let's look through our spyglass and find the train. Hi, Tilly. Hello, Arlo. And hello, friend. Do you have a special story from the Bible you could show us today? Let's find out together. Come on, friend. All aboard the Bible train. 
of the Bible Junior. Daniel. Let's meet Daniel. Oh, hey! Who worked for the Babylonian king. Daniel loved God and tried to do the right thing. Daniel was a good man and he made the kings glad. But this made the other court officials jealous and mad. Yeah. Wait! Daniel prayed to God three times a day. So the officials thought, Come on! They'd get him this way. They went to the king. <laughs> Excuse me, your majesty. And told him to make a decree. It would say, No one can pray to any god but me. I like it. Daniel heard the law, and he prayed as he always did. The court officials caught him gotcha. and threw him in the lion's den. This made the king sad, and he hoped God would rescue him. But the law said to seal the den with Daniel trapped in. In the morning, hey, Daniel. the king asked Daniel if he was all right. And Daniel said that God shut the lion's mouth tight. Daniel was safe and there was not a scratch in sight. For he trusted God, and he saved him from the lions that night. <laughs> I love that story. I wonder what other stories I could hear from the Bible. Did you know that we can always find more stories in God's special book? All we have to do is open up the Bible and take a look. Well, I have to take this train to the next stop. See you around, friend. And bye, Arlo. Bye, Tilly. Choo-choo. <laughs> Daniel was so brave, and he did the right thing. God kept him safe from the lions. Daniel was friends with God, and God wants to be our friend, too. I know that God is just the best friend that we could have, because God made us and loves us. I have an idea. Let's sing a song to thank God for being a great friend. Here we go.
<laughs> Thank you, God. God is so great. God made you, God loves you, and God wants to be your friend. Let me think. What are some fun things I could do with my friend God? Maybe we could look at the clouds together, or splash in the waves together, or build a sandcastle together. Oh boy, all those sound like such fun things to do with our friend God. Remember that even though we can't see God, He's always with us. Thank you for coming to see me at Happy Harbor today. I hope you have fun with your friend God today. See you around, friend. Bye. Parents, it's time to celebrate. The new On Purpose Parents Podcast, a Saddleback Parents Podcast has arrived. And we're here to help you win at parenting. As parents ourselves, we know that parenting is the toughest, most important job on the planet. You can't possibly do it alone. And now you don't have to because we're your people. Connect with us by texting the word parents to the number 83000, visiting us at onpurposeparents.com and tuning in every Wednesday with Kurt, Grace, and Chris for tips, ideas, and encouragement to help you win at being an on-purpose parent.